hey welcome back thank you so much for watching yet another video this is lesson 2 of module 1 of microsoft 365 fundamentals in the previous lesson you were introduced to some of the basic computing concept you are now ready to learn about microsoft specific cloud offerings microsoft 365 in particular in this lesson, you will be introduced to Microsoft Azure and Microsoft 365. You will then compare Microsoft 365 with Office 365 to better understand when a business would adapt to one or the other. You will also review alternative third-party cloud offerings and see what value Microsoft 365 subscription deliver compared to other subscription. After this lesson, you should be able to describe what is Microsoft Azure? Describe what is Microsoft 365. You will be able to list the primary products and services that include in Microsoft 365 subscription. And you would be able to successfully describe the benefits of Microsoft 365 service as well. So without wasting any more time, let's jump right back into lesson two, which is Microsoft Cloud Services. Microsoft Azure is cloud computing platform used for building, developing, and managing applications and services through a global network of Microsoft managed data center. Access to both infrastructure and services on Azure enable you to quickly deliver new and innovative features to your users or customers. Projects that once took months can now often be completed in weeks or days. Azure delivers the power of the cloud. You just need to know how to harness it. In fact, it contains more than 100 services, including Azure Active Directory. Sometimes it can be known as Azure AD or AAD, Azure Information Prediction, Backup Services, Content Delivery Network, Key Vault, Machine Learning, uh, Media Services, etc. So let me give you a quick high level on what are these services all about. Azure AD provides identity management and access control capabilities for your cloud applications. It can be synchronized with your on-prem domain controller, and you can also enable single sign-on to simplify your user access. Azure Information Protection protect Confidential or sensitive information by using encryption, identity, and authorization policies. Azure Backup, for example, allow you to backup to and restore from the cloud using familiar tools in Windows Server 2016, 2019, or in fact 2012 as well, or Microsoft System Center uh, Desk Data Protection Manager. Content Delivery Network allows you to deliver high bandwidth content to users around the world with low latency and high availability via a robust network of global data center. Key Vault offers an easy, cost-effective way to safeguard your keys and other secrets in the cloud using hardware security models. Uh, Hardware security modules are called HSMs. Machine learning allows you to easily design, test, operationalize, and manage predictive analysis solutions in the cloud. Media services, on the other hand, offers cloud-based media solutions from several existing technologies, including ingest, encoding, format, uh, content protection and both on demand and live streaming capabilities. Mobile services provides a scalable cloud backend for building Microsoft Store, Windows Phone, Apple, iOS, Android, and HTML JavaScript applications. It can be used to store data in the cloud, authenticate with users, or send push notification to your application within minutes. Multi-factor authentication or MFA. By having more than one method of authentication, you can help prevent unauthorized access to both on-prem and cloud applications. 
Stream Analytics provides an event-based processing engine that helps uncover insights from devices, sensors, cloud infrastructure, and existing data properties in real time. Virtual machine enable you to deploy a Windows Server or Linux image in the cloud. And virtual network, for example, enable you to create virtual private network within Azure and then securely link this network with an on-prem network. These are some of the very few high-level services which is included in Microsoft Azure. So what is Microsoft 365? Microsoft 365 is a pay-as-you-go SaaS offering that include Microsoft Office 365, Windows 10, and EMS, which is called Enterprise Mobility Plus Security. When you purchase Microsoft 365 Enterprise, you get these following products, Office 365, Windows 10, and EMS. Office 365 include your latest Office apps for your PC and your Mac, like Word, Excel, PowerPoint, and Outlook. And full suite of online services for email, file storage, and collaborations meeting, and more. Windows 10, for example, which is a most productive and secure version of Windows with comprehensive deployment and device and app management capability. Enterprise Mobility Plus Security, or EMS, designed to help manage and protect users, devices, apps, and data in the mobile-first, cloud-first world, which include Microsoft Intune, Azure AD Premium, and Azure Rights Management Services. So let's look at the benefits of Microsoft 365 services. By connecting Office 365, Windows 10 Enterprise, and Enterprise Mobility and Security into a single subscription model, Microsoft 365 helps you drive digital transformation in four key areas. First is unlock, unlocks creativity. Microsoft 365 provides powerful capabilities that includes AI-powered tools to unleash your organization's creativity and fuel innovations. Built for teamwork, which represents Microsoft 365 enables teamwork and collaborations through intuitive tools that increase service scalability and allow you to work together in real time. Microsoft Teams is the hub for teamwork, where you can chat, hold meetings, and share files and app. Outlook is available for iOS and Android, brings emails, calendar, contacts, and documents securely together so you can share files and coordinate schedules and book meetings wherever you go. Integrated for simplicity means Microsoft 365 helps you reduce IT complexity increase agility and lower cost by making technology easier to adopt and manage. Finally, intelligent security is where Microsoft 365 delivers holistic security across users, devices, apps, and data. In addition to Microsoft, Amazon and Google also offers cloud services, respectively known as Amazon Web Services and Google Cloud. Similar to Azure, AWS and Google Cloud offer scalable computing on-demand for cloud-based compute power. The differences are in pricing model and exactly what services are supported. Every business is different. There is no single cloud environment that is best choice for all. When determining which cloud service provider to use, each organization should review the following questions. What deployment, and manage, what deployment and management tools and operating systems are we using? What productivity solutions are employees using? What's the scale of our on-prem infrastructure? How important is compliance and privacy to our cloud-based operations? The Microsoft Cloud offering can be an excellent solution for companies with any of these following requirements. So that's the end of lesson two. We were able to understand what are the Microsoft Cloud services, 
Now you will be able to describe what's, what's Microsoft Azure. You will be able to describe what's Microsoft 365, and you can list the primary products and services that are included in the Microsoft 365 subscription. And I'm sure you will be able to describe the benefits of Microsoft 365 services as well. In the next lesson, we are going to go through migrating to cloud services. So let's look at migrating to cloud services in the next video. I'll see you on the next one. Till then, peace.